tis the night before the snowflake festival and all is not well. A pink flamingo is gone and no one can tell. So right now we're looking for a pink flamingo with Mandy as we're searching a fresh body of water. Hopefully to try to find it in time for the snowflake festival. And Delbert apparently just got another hand in his skill to make it level four. Okay, Mandy, where are you going? I thought you were going to a fresh body of water. Not, not there. Wow. Okay, yeah, well. I guess that's why they call it a strand because you gotta run all the way down to it. This might be one of the few locations where you could search for a clue. In the middle of a blizzard? Maybe not so. But as time will tell, we'll see if it's where the flamingo did go. Let's... Can't search for clues. Okay, well that's a disappointment. No, we don't extreme swim. Though it would be pretty extreme. What about you, sir? What are you doing? You're eating cake slice. Well, that's awfully nice, but... Maybe it's time for you to take a... Bathroom break and a shower break. I wonder what that tanker did. I think he f gave it auto flush or auto clean or something. He did something with the toilet, so either way, it's pretty good. Okay, now she's hungry as well, and it's already Thursday. Well, okay, time's running out. We'll have to pick this up in the morning. You'll have to snoop for clues then. It's time for everyone to hit the bed. Wait a minute. Thought I heard something in the neighborhood. Someone's up to no good. All is not well for one sim who was well. Mandy came down with the flu and is no longer any good. Well, she's got the holiday cheer, but unfortunately, that's about it. What is this? Throw a gift-giving party? Well, first, my dear, you're going to have to get some rest because she got the flu by being out in this cold, cold weather. And here it is, Snowflake Morn. 5.20 a.m. to be exact. As for Delbert, what are you doing, Delbert? You can't do that. She's sleeping. Well, that's very romantic that you want to kiss her well. Okay, well, you're going to have to go ahead and do some other things, like... Making a good breakfast would be a good thing to have. How about... Serve a... Waffle breakfast. Plenty of time during the day to have fun. Mandy's bedridden, at least it may seem. Holy crap. So she's got two days to get over this flu? Oh my. That usually involves vomiting. Didn't think I was going to be able to rhyme that one, so... Yeah, I'm not going to even try it. I don't even know why I started rhyming. Alright, well at least she can get some rest. He'll go ahead and do some more food making. It's down in the basement. Oh yeah, I gotta put more stuff down in the basement too as well. Since these guys don't even have a TV yet, I should probably go ahead and get him one. Now she wants to eat spaghetti. Okay, there's that tendency to have certain cravings. And mac and cheese. And... Okay. That she's pregnant. Okay, the game has confirmed it. Okay, now she can go ahead and work it? I don't know. And Delbert gets a skill point level 5. Very nice. Mandy gets the next four days off as maternity leave. Holy crap. What well, don't matter. As a detective, she gets them off anyway. She makes her own schedule. Snow day has arrived. Of course we know snowflake day has arrived. Wow, well, she wants to rest until 11 a.m.? Maybe we should throw a gift-giving party. Chertog! Narsa! Delbert, get away from the computer. She's trying to rest. Then again, we should have his mirror elsewhere, too. Where can we have this mirror where we can actually use it? Yeah, that would be a more reasonable spot. It's pregnant and glowing. Um, maybe later. I was gonna hit never, but I was like, you never know. What are you doing? Why are you... Oh, he's just chatting. 
She's in bed sleeping, still feeling germy and nauseous. At least germy for the time being. Okay. Throw up. Okay, there we go. Okay, you're gonna throw up outside? Oh, this is gonna be lovely. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no. Well, at least we gotta clean it up. I guess there's one good thing. Wow, she's not even, like, trying to get rest. Oh, okay, we should probably have a gift-giving party. But, wow, she's gonna be sick. Just get, get some rest. Sheesh. Don't read the book, get some rest. I actually should probably get a, a shower before she gets some rest. Then get some extreme sleep. And then Delbert can go ahead and take care of the rest. Oh yeah, probably should put those away. Don't let their leftovers rot out there. Put them away! Sheesh! Oh, look. Let me guess, more bills to pay. Wow, what was all that about? Sheesh! I didn't have no letters before, and now the main man's getting, like, ridiculous. Or I should say, the male lady. She just slammed them letters down. Holy crap. Somebody must have peed on her Cheerios. I don't think I have two bills to pay, because I didn't see in there a couple hours ago. Yep. That was weird. Okay, well, apparently she has a problem. Alright, time to go ahead and eat some leftovers, then we'll throw a snowflake party. Some leftovers, let Manny get some rest, and we'll have a party a little bit later on. Read a pregnancy book, and... Have a boy. Yeah, that's interesting. The lifetime happiness points are very nice. Have first child, 5,000. Have a boy, another 5,000. <laughs> oh, wow, that is, like, crazy. I'll have to drop that one. What the heck? Oh, that's just another paper. It's all good. I was gonna say, what in the world? Well, it looks like we got an invitation for a feast. Greetings, Delbert. We're throwing a feast party for the neighborhood, and I'm hoping you can come. Bring a guest if you would like, but more importantly, a big appetite. Ooh. And I love how I pay this maid just to go ahead and throw away the paper and straighten up the bed. Can I view the invitation? 1 p.m. What? What? It's freezing out and they want to have swimwear? Uh, no thanks. That's just crazy talk. Thanks for the invite, but if you think I'm wearing swimwear out in this, you're crazy! Congratulations, Delbert has just improved his handiness skill to level 5. Very nice. So by tinkering on the toilet, he got even more of a handiness skill. Alright, enough playing around. We're gonna have our own little feast. What was that? Okay, we know about Atagizmo here. Pull out a gadget out there. Tinkering is a random and sometimes dangerous activity. But Delbert has persevered and has given this object the unbreakable upgrade. Ooh, I like that. I likey likey that. Okay, you know what? Throw a party. We're, we're having a party right here. However she's feeling. Aching back. Okay, from pregnancy. Jeremy from being sick and all that other good stuff. Okay. So she's feeling full-blown crappy right now. Um, house party? No, we're having a gift-giving party. We have no feast. So, yeah, we're gonna have it at 2 o'clock. How do you like them apples? And we're gonna have... stuff. I guess we could have you. Wait a minute. Holy crap, we got a lot of people to invite. Oh, just start inviting everybody. Whoever comes, comes. Whoever don't, well, then guess what? That's your loss. Bachelor, Simus Bachelor, and who else? And 
Okay, so I guess we'll have to do it one at a time. Goth or Goth. And Mortimer. Mortimer. Holy crap, he's a kid. Okay. Who else? Anybody else? Dante Di Sabatino. And I guess that's going to be it. So we got two, in two strangers invited to the party. Very, very nice. Well, you know what? We're going to get rid of you. And... I don't know, because I'm working on a case for you doesn't mean you can come. Who else can we get? Who else is a close friend? Nobody. Okay, so I guess you can come after all. I don't know. This... It's just so hard. Um... Anybody else? Oh, Monica, there we go. That'll do. That'll spice things up just to say a little bit to say the least. Dress code. Just go with casual. Why not? This ain't a swimwear party. Sheesh. Now it's time to repair the food and get things ready. There isn't enough room in your home to put a gift pile. You better clear some room before the first guest arrives. Okay, so that sounds interesting. Can we move some stuff around? We're gonna have to move some stuff around, to say the least. Yep, we'll put you there. Then we'll put you there, and then I guess we'll put you like this. Hmm, very interesting, to say the least. I have no idea. Can I sell you and get a light over here for this? Well, let's see, maybe a ceiling light or something, you know? Well, this would be a good ceiling light for here. Then, I don't know, maybe a wall light. I, it's hard to tell. So many options. So many options. There we go. To be a social butterfly, just plan to party. He won't soon forget that fun and revelry that is sure to come. And then he's gonna go to bed. Because why not? You throw a party, then you go to bed and sleep right through it. Order a pizza? That may be a good idea. Go ahead and order a pizza. You ain't going to sleep. Come on. The party's just beginning. Call for services? Order that pizza. I don't think Mandy will be too hungry. Well, then again, she's getting hungry. Well, there we go. The party's already started. Let's go ahead and get that pizza ordered. Hurry up and get that pizza ordered. Oh, wow. They put it... On the table. Very nice. Okay, so we got that achievement. Oh, wow. Okay, so... Everyone's just, like, gonna come in and that dude's raiding right my fridge already, because why not? And they're bringing food? Wa bring waffles! Why wouldn't you bring waffles to a party? Baked angel? What? I can't even tell. Why is there fish and chips here? I thought this was a gift-giving party, not a food-giving party. Jeez, look at all this food they brought. Holy crap. Here, everyone... Holy, there goes a, all the presents in the middle? Okay. Everyone get in here and bring your presents in and... Drop them so we can go ahead and have a big party. No, you ain't going to bed. Get up. Sheesh. Here, I'm going to call everyone to open presents. Ready or not, go open presents. If I had the proper expansion, we could have had Santa Claus here. Alright, everyone, go open your gifts. Stop misbehaving and open your gifts. Sheesh. I knew it was going to be crowded, but I think it was going to be this crowded. You unlocked the Heavenly Warmth Achievement and earned a badge. What else did we earn? Delivery, please. Achievement, earned a badge. Okay. And receive that pizza. Alright, we gotta get out of here. Go, go get that pizza. Oh, now what broke? And, of course, the dishwasher broke. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so y'all open your gifts. 
<laughs> and I'm gonna have to get the pizza. Now, if I didn't even bring in all this food, I wouldn't have ordered the pizza. Sheesh. People don't communicate. It's the problem these days. What in the heck? Rude guest. Who's being rude? What the heck? Put away the leftovers then. The pizza dude was just like, here, whatever. I'm just gonna set it on the ground for you. Okay, what about Mandy? Okay, she's watching the gifts being opened. Well, I guess if you're not gonna be doing anything, Dalbert, you can go ahead and fix that wash machine. Yep, go ahead and repair that sucker. You've got the skill for it. Don't go back to bed. You're not ready for sleep just yet. You would like to improve your handiness skill, though, right? Uh, we don't need to talk to Jody or buy a buffet table. That's not in the budget right now. Fixing that dishwasher machine, though, is. Everybody else is just in the living room, I guess, reveling in the holiday spirit. What else does he have? Filthy surroundings. The grime and muck is really starting to pile high. What grime and muck? Dover, stop being a party pooper. Eating baked angel food cake? Why are you going in the bathroom, sitting on the toilet, eating angel food cake? Okay. Whatever. Not going to question it anymore. And now you can't even use the toilet because she's sitting on it. How lovely. <laughs> Alright, well, something's about to give here because you gotta go and she's sitting on a toilet. Wow, what a party. I think I'm partied out, though. Bye. Okay, well, see you later. Okay, you got your 30 simoleons for the pizza. Sheesh. Okay, so he got his gift and left. Look at all this food we got. Holy crap. What are we going to do with this food? I know what we're going to do with this food. We're going to put this away in the fridge. This is leftovers. Wait, we got a cobbler pie? Oh, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Sheesh. Too many people. Here. Something's about to get put away. And then, of course, they put the food on the floor. Unreal. Dobert's like, whatever, the gifts are being opened, I'm gonna go get on a computer. Why not? Why not? Okay, she's eating fish and chips. What in the heck? Oh, okay, she's wearing her Halloween mask. I was gonna say, what in the world? How did that happen? And why is she ringing my doorbell? So many questions, not enough answers. Trick or treat? It's not even Halloween! What in the world? Un freaking real. I don't know where these sims come from, but. Oh well. It's a snowflake party where we've gotten trick or treaters, and now they're all leaving. Wow. Now everyone's leaving. Let's go ahead and put away some of these leftovers. Is there any gifts left for Delbert and Mandy? Apparently not. What is this? Flirt with somebody else? Oh, wow. He really is having a midlife crisis. Sheesh. How much is left on this midnight crisis deal? Four more days. Oh, wow. Well... Against better judgment, I'm going to go ahead and promise this. Only because I know one way how we could fix it. Sandy French, please don't tell me you're here to trick or treat. Sandy, if you are, you better get out of here. Who's calling? Okay, she's on the PC. He's going to answer the door and answer the cell phone. Unreal. What in the world? 
Delbert learned that Sandy is a slob. Wonderful. That is just wonderful. And neurotic. And excitable. Alright, well, since you're so eager to go ahead and get this done, I know exactly the perfect household to take you to. Um, I thought I knew the perfect household to take you to. Where is it? Or maybe it's... they're not home? There's the bachelor pad. The bachelor pad. Delbert's party was awesome, verging on epic. Sims all around town will be talking about this one for years. Well, that's a pretty good thing. Okay, so they all got their achievement for that, or they got their accomplishment for that. But where is that household? Okay, she come from the single mom's household, okay. So, let me see. All guests are finally gone, and Delbert is pretty much going to stay in because he can't find a lot of available households, basically. I think everyone's out celebrating the Snowflake Day festivities. And, of course, whoever didn't come here probably had their own plans accordingly anyway. So, who, who's calling you now? He won't even answer his phone. How lovely is that? Answer cell phone. Okay, someone's gonna have to clean this mess up, too. Oh, well, that's what the maid's for. He'll be here tomorrow. The heck with it. Vita, Vita Alto. Okay, sh no thanks. Social's already packed out. We don't need to do any more. Clean up the whole area because this house is a bloody mess. Oh, okay, so we actually replaced self-cleaning with Unbreakable. But I kind of like the Unbreakable, so I'm not going to do that. Just might as well go ahead and leave Unbreakable on there. We can actually upgrade it to self-cleaning shower. That's very nice. Hmm, interesting options indeed. Talk to Mandy. Holy... What in the world is going on with him? He is like a train wreck. But, I mean, he can get a lot of lifetime happiness points by just doing those things. Wow. Holy crap. I wonder if it's possible to get... Well, it's too late now, so he can't give her a call. Hmm. Very interesting indeed.